Hello everyone, I'm Maidavel, welcome to my channel. This week I show you how to make this beautiful coat. It is a size for a girl of 3 years but inside the video I give the measurements for more sizes. Here behind. Here more closely. Let's make a square neck. With 75 chains. Fifteen and fifteen for the sleeves. Fifteen back, fifteen and fifteen front. In each corner we will make one double crochet, one chain, one double crochet. It will be the increases. We will work like this during all rounds of the neck. Start with 75 chains. One round, two chains. One half double crochet in each chain. We continue until we reach 15 half double crochet. When we have the 15 half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet in the same stitch. We continue until we reach 15 half double crochet. When we have the 15 half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet in the same stitch. We continue until we reach 15 half double crochet. When we have the 15 half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet in the same stitch. We continue until we reach 15 half double crochet. When we have the 15 half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet in the same stitch. We continue until we reach 15 half double crochet.
two round, two chains. Let's make the buttonholes. Two chains. Skip two stitch. If you want the smallest buttonholes, just make one chain and skip one stitch. I made the buttonhole every six rounds. Two chains. Skip two stitch. Three half double crochet. Two chains. Skip two stitch. Continue with half double crochet to the corner. Remember to count. If in the one round you had 15 half double crochet now you must have 16 half double crochet. When we get to the corner, we will make one half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet. Continue until you reach the other corner with half double crochet. When we get to the corner, we will make one half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet. Continue until you reach the other corner with half double crochet. When we get to the corner, we will make one half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet. Continue until you reach the other corner with half double crochet. When we get to the corner, we will make one half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet. We continue until finishing the front. We work all the same rounds. Increase in each corner one half double crochet, one chain, one half double crochet. We counted stitches well in all rounds. In each round is increased. 1 and 1 stitch on the front, 2 and 2 stitch on the sleeves, 2 on the back. When we reach the buttonholes we will make one half double crochet in each stitch.
We will make the buttonholes every six rounds. I worked for 17 rounds or 16 centimeters. We make a fold back in the center of the back of 40 chains. We make two folds in front of 10 chains each. We mark with wool of another color the center of the back. In the front I have counted on 10 stitch from the corner. As we see in the video. Why 10? Because we are looking for the center of the front without the buttonhole. In case you do it bigger or smaller. Once marked fold we start with a skirt of the coat. We start with two chains in one half double crochet on each stitch until you get to fold. I only have six buttonhole but you can do whatever you want. When we got to the fold we made 10 chains. We continue as seen in the video. We arrived at the first corner. Once we reach the first corner skip all stitches of the sleeve. We continue with half double crochet until we reach the fold of the back. When we get to the center of the back, We will make 40 chains. When we have the 40 chains, we continue with half double crochet to the next corner.
Watch out. Do not twist the chain. We come to the corner, skip the sleeve. Continue until you reach the fold. When we arrive we make 10 chains. We continue until we reach the end of the round. The next round we will make one half double crochet in each chain. In the chains of fold we will also make half double crochet. Continue until you reach the mid-back fold. When we reach the 40 fold chains, we will do the same. Working with half a double crochet in each chain.
we continue working with half double crochet until reaching the desired length. is reversible. The sleeves We start under the arm. Two chains, one half double crochet on each stitch. We work a round of the sleeve on the outside. Finish round with slip stitch. The next round we worked inside the sleeve. As seen in the video. Two chains, one half double crochet on each stitch. Work in half double crochet all the sleeve. Remember, work one round on the outside and one inside. Hood. We will start after the button holes. As seen in the video. Two chains, one half double crochet on each stitch. We continue until the end of the round.
We will reach the other end. We work with half double crochet until reaching the necessary length. I have worked for 20 centimeters or 8 inches. For the reverse and without cutting the thread, We will fold in half with slip stitch we will close. As seen in the video. without tightening. When we reach the end we cut the thread. Inside the hood and around with half double crochet we will make 6 rounds. Two chains, one half double crochet on each stitch. Inside the hood and around with half double crochet we will make six rounds. So the front folds as seen in the video.
We will sew the fold from behind as seen in the video.
I've sewn this lace around the coat. I thought it was a better idea than making crab or crochet stitches. If you want to do it with wool, we will do crab stitch. We will do it all over the coat. If you want to do it single crochet, we will do the whole coat. We will stitch the lace around the sleeves, hood, front and back. I hope you liked it. Thank you very much for seeing me. Thank you very much for following me. I'll wait for you next Monday with another tutorial.